The life cycle of a star begins within a nebula, a massive cloud of gas and dust. Under the force of gravity, parts of the nebula collapse to form a protostar. Subscribe to the protostar gathers more mass and heats up. Nuclear fusion ignites in its core, marking its transition into a main sequence star, the longest and most stable phase of its life, where it fuses hydrogen into helium. When the hydrogen supply runs low, the star evolves depending on its mass. Smaller stars, like our Sun, swell into red giants and eventually shed their outer layers, leaving behind a white dwarf that cools over time. Larger stars expand into red supergiants and may end their lives in a massive supernova explosion. The remnants of the supernova can form either a neutron star or a black hole. Thus, the death of stars also seeds the galaxy with heavier elements, fueling the birth of new stars.